what I'm about to tell you might change the way you see your own hair. And no, it's not fashion, it's neuroscience. Hair is more than just appearance. Each hair follicle is surrounded by nerve endings, turning every strand into a tiny sensor for vibrations, temperature and touch. In animals like cats or mice, this is obvious with their whiskers. But in humans, it still works, just in a subtler way. Hair whirls, those spirals on your scalp, are unique to you. Their direction and location can reveal fascinating things about how your brain developed before you were even born. And some people have two whirls, which may suggest their brain works a little differently. Your hair type, straight, wavy, curly, is shaped by the follicle itself and your DNA. Across cultures, hair evolved with climate. Thick, dark hair in cold regions to keep warmth in. Fine or curly hair in hot climates to help release heat. In people with Down syndrome, hair often shares certain traits. Finer texture, sometimes straighter or softly wavy, and slower growth. Unusual whirl patterns are also more common, possibly linked to the way the skull develops in the womb. And here's a mystery from history. Some ancient cultures and even military reports claim that cutting hair short reduced sensory awareness, while long hair could make you more intuitive, more in tune with the world around you. So, is your hair just decoration, or is it a hidden extension of your mind?